Uh, hello guys, this is Codex here, and I'm making another video. Um, so this is like a special video I'm doing, because it's for Paris, otherwise known as Par 73, on Gate of Storms. And he sent me a private message saying it was his birthday and everything, so I decided it would be cool to make him a video, you know. And yeah, I hope you enjoy it, um, Paris. And yes, yeah, so just like Paris is a real cool guy and everything, and just to tell you about some of the stuff he's done. Um, well, right now he is first Game place on. in the current free for all league, which happens every Wednesday between 8:30 and 10:30 p.m. That's EST, and. I think it's new, but it's now happening every Thursday between 2 and 4 p.m. And as well as that, he also um, is captaining a team in McCritty's draft, McCritty's draft tournament. Flag captured. And their team is Flag first contested. place at the moment, I think. Um, I'm also playing in that tournament, but I don't think we're first place. So at the moment, his team is beating us. Um, and also, another thing he's done recently is he won the Slugfest tournament, which Drunken Deer, um, organized. So Slugfest is a type of unit training in MF2, which is minimum, um, artillery units and maxed out melee units. Also, um, Drunken's take on a Slugfest is also involves dwarves and a few other units like that. Um, anyway, so the game has started. This is this is a replay of one of the free throw games Paris played in. Um, it was in week seven of the free throw tournament, which I think was last week. And yeah, so this is King of the Hill. And the map is Killing Grounds. So just to give you give people who haven't haven't played this before or aren't used to the game types, killing um King of the Hill pretty much means you have to hold the flag for the longest. So when you're walking over the flag, this timer starts and so the person with the longest time flag, or flag wins, right? Flag contested. So the whole point is to try keep the flag for the longest, but also not um, not sacrifice your units. So it's really key not to rush and get your units wiped out in the first few minutes, and then suffer from not having enough units and not being a big enough threat for the rest of the match, which is usually what happens to me. So um, the players are. Funk, who I think is the host, um, Indent, um, Mad Becker, Doom, who are on a team, Mad Becker is the captain, uh, Paris, Oblix, and Falcon. So, this is free for all, however, there can be teams. I Five think, minutes in remaining. The so, free for all basically is. Um, Flag captured. I think Overlox is actually flag AFK. contested. I'm not sure. I think he drops out. Maybe. Anyway. Oh no. Sorry. Sorry. He's there. He's just out there. Um. Yeah. He's over there. He's just keeping some of his units. Um. Anyway, what I was gonna say. Free for all. Um. Me, there can still be teams, Flag but contested. there just needs to be more than two teams, so it's not like a two-team game. So as long as there's more than two teams, it's a free for all match, I think. So you can have a team if you want. And I'm not sure. I think um, yeah. So pretty much like the scores are added up at the end of each week. Flag contested. And that that like is a prediction on who's winning. So if you're in a team, you're not going Flag to be making contested. as many points as like Max is making at the moment, um, just by playing on his own, which is um, 
Yeah, so what I mean is, if, if you don't play as a team, you'll make more points and you're more likely to come first in the tournament. Okay, so um, with that said, Paris started off um, not really holding the flag, but now flag he's contested. actually at the top of the list. So, if you're not sure, it's like color coded. So, if you on Paris's units, these are his units here. Flag so, he just contested. has to be careful uh, keeping his distance with his uh, artillery from Doom's parents. But he actually managed that quite well with his doors there. Um, yeah. Team eliminated. So, he's just um, eliminated. Mad Becker and Doom. Player from the eliminated. Game. Flag contested. Yeah. Um, just for So that's what I was saying before about conserving your units uh, for the end game. So what's pretty much happening here is Fung is trying to contest the flag with his herons, and, and Oblix is also trying to contest and has quite a large force here. Um, which he left behind at the start, but he's making his way up so, um, yeah, so, this is the dance, yes, he's got some fun over here, right now he's not really a big threat to the flag, um, but Obelix needs to be careful with his units against Paris, because, As you can see, um, yes. Harris really is contesting the flag at the moment, and he's got his archers in like a long line formation, so he's pretty much pushing everyone off at the moment. Um, yeah, so now there's kind of like a 1v1 going on here between Funk and Obelix, with, and and indent so funk at the moment is like in the middle and that was close that there was a dud which caught which might cost him his dwarf. yeah which cost him his dwarf and his ghoul there so you have to be careful because in myth when you when a dwarf throws a ball there can be a dud um which means the bottle goes out so and that can that can uh, differentiate like the difference between winning a match and losing. Um, so yeah, at the moment I think Paris has won since he's got five minutes on the flag, whereas Oblix has only got two minutes. And yeah, so this is the last thirty remaining. seconds of the game, but a lot can happen still. I mean, obviously no one can be Paris at the moment, but. Everyone's still fighting for the flag to get points and everything. Um, yeah, he just took out Oblux's army with his claws there. Flag captured. And it looks like his flag archers contested. are almost dead. Flag captured. Yeah, and... Player eliminated. Yeah, so... Paris wins Game this. over. Um... Yeah, so... If you look at the scores, um, Paris has a damage of 171, um, which is pretty good, <laughs> and he's got like 50 kills and 10 survivors, so he clearly won by a lot here. Um, yeah, so, you know, I might make a few more videos, um, so I hope to see you guys later then. Oh yeah, thanks, hope you enjoyed this. Yay! Yay!